goats alongside cattle seem to be quite an unusual kind of addition to Jesse's system, but allow Jesse to show you how they work for him. So here's the nice thing about goats is that if they get out, if, you, if you're giving them a little bit of a treat, like a bucket of grain a day, they'll follow you into a fire if you've got that bucket of grain. If they get out, they'll go right back in. They could care less about freedom. You know, they, they, want their, they want their treats. But what's unique about mixing goats and cattle together that I noticed, the cattle will eat certain things and not others, and the goats will slick up the rest. We actually watch the goats eat bull thistle. They, they will go up to a bull thistle and they'll strip that thing down to just a stick sticking up and there's nothing left. And so we were experimenting, trying maybe a little bit of organic stuff so we, we couldn't spray. And we had a lot of sow thistle, a lot of bull thistle, a lot, a lot, of, a lot of different weeds out there, lamb's quarter. Uh, I think that pretty much covers it water hemp. We actually sent in a relative feed value on it and surprisingly, the, 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 all those weeds weren't half bad feed. But the cattle went through and they kind of ate what they wanted to eat and the goats come through and they slicked up all, all the rest and, and when it comes to the end of it all, their gains were just dead spot on what you wanted a bred heifer to be. I mean, I don't have a lot of experience with it, but all the guys I talked to that raised bred heifers told me, wow, that, that actually worked out pretty well.